Uh, greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Have a Look at uh, Uricon, my strategy. Uh, at the moment we've got plenty of stuff. Alright, so what do I want to develop next? Because I'm kind of looking for other empires to start finishing their uh, things. And getting all the way up to the Vermilion Court probably is going to take too long. And getting the negotiate costs in the Hive Lands, which is where that's all the way over here. That's not really, really our concern. I mean, I might want to go into Fetid, probably the Glass Desert, but anywhere else, no. Oh, you only need to have access to 15 uh, landmarks. I don't need to build them myself, so I really want to stay close to where I am. Alright, let's make sure that our gateway over here is safe. Alright, he, he's gonna expand some resources to take cities. Let's, uh, let's see, how much does it take? He's got 10k violence on hand. I can't beat that at the moment. So, I'm not gonna try. Instead, I'm gonna let him just expand some of that resource and then come after him later. But it does mean I need to start stocking up on some violence myself, because I don't want to get caught flat-footed when he starts to go for me. Just let him let him fight with uh, Goros Mog. Because, and they've got about equal amounts of violence on hand. So if they can slug each other to death, that's fine with me. And see, that's what I don't want. I'm gonna respond. That's... that's annoying. <laughs> I mean, yeah, sure, that is also an option. I don't I don't have the recruits yet for that. So... I need way more secrets, way more fear. And I don't have either. Let's keep recruiting. Negotiating. I mean, I have to wait until uh, their resources run out a bit. So I could nurture some places. Right. Where do we need some prosperity? Well, everywhere, most likely. don't have anything to recruit. Alright, here we have a slight problem. I can only respond to one city. So, where do I respond? I'll respond to that. And another city has defected. Ugh, this is annoying. Right, I need some fear. It's going to take quite a bit to take that back, but... Eh. It is being threatened, respond. Alright, so you are going full annoyance on me. Their fight's quite relaxed. How much do you have? Barely anything. Right, for now I'll just swat away your attacks, but I need to do some more trading. And that's a fair deal, actually. Let's see, the Fever Kingdom is also not in a mood to negotiate with these assholes. Um, I could negotiate for that. That's a fairly cheap. Yeah, and they immediately take it back. Right. Uh, 
can just steal some more resources somewhere. This is a spiral you can get into. The enemy tries to keep doing this. Alright. But that will have expanded some of the resources, so. Right. I really need more more stuff. Right. Anything I can worth that's worth stealing. I really, I really need some more goods. Nobody has any. Alright, some fear will also help with the recruitment. numbers would be very useful if uh, I could get him into a pincer where someone else is also trying to go for one of his cities I don't think I can ever go for that I could try to infiltrate I don't have enough secrets for that though yeah let's just steal some more At least that one will not fall to capture tactics. But that's also not what I'm most worried about at the moment. Alright, let's just go into the back country over here. Some more cities under our control. So, uh, where can we get the most violence from? And the most labor? Right. That should at least help us a little bit. Let's see if we cannot exhaust this supply. Didn't think you'd make it that easy. really aggressively uh, going for stuff. Why does nobody want to have any goods for me to trade? I 
really need to keep on top of getting some more violence. Because otherwise he'll just outmaneuver me. Which cities of mine actually produce violence? See if I can nurture them to be slightly stronger. My faction destroyed Chirping Tribe that's in this crater over here. That's none of our concern because I know that these tribes cannot leave this crater until they have conquered all of them. Uh, although. I think Chirping Tribe is actually the most violent of the three, so this is probably fine. So far, nothing truly unusual has happened. Poison Crusade is probably one of the more annoying things that can happen. do capture quickly. I just cool. It's probably a faction over here. I think. Alright, how much do they have left? About 7,000, that's way more than I have. Let's get some secrets. And uh, now I want to respond. Now there is a slightly nifty trick you can do. And basically, in order to maintain control over your cities, you need to have a, a connection to them. So if you manage to sever the connection, uh, you will effectively just make sure uh, make these cities that are no longer connected revert to uh, neutral eventually. Right, I need way more stuff to do that. Um, Just keep building as well. And now you start coming into this. You suck. Um, need so much more violence. That's deep enough to respond to. I mean, you've got plenty of stuff. Right, I don't have enough love, I need more, more fear, and I don't definitely don't have enough secrets. Uh, infiltration only really works for uh, when you want to capture something. That doesn't really matter, although... Um, fair enough deal. Seriously, does nobody have any goods? Well, I've got plenty of machines, let's nurture some more. Bahastis. There's Bahastis. It looks like the f uh, the familiar court is a little bit in trouble. Bahastis. 
hard to get rid of this, but it doesn't matter. We need to deal with the Poison Crusade. Right. You give me the best deal. City has defected, that's annoying but not unsurprising. expand too quickly because your initial hold on the city is quite low. Prosperity is also not great over here. Go away! I want to waste my violence on you. Goods. All right. Anyone has any goods to sell? Not really. All right. That's a fair enough trade, I guess. Any goods to steal? New faction arises. The Stampede. All right. That's over here. A horde of feral beasts has crossed over from the wilderness to the east. They seek to settle down among the soft and weak nations of the civilized world. Gradually converts beasts of burden into feral beasts. Yeah, that's no great for us, but it's not really concerning because uh, the eastern mark race will have to deal with them first. So, we can focus on dealing with this upstart. All I really need is a slight advantage in recruitment. So I can outpower his ability to uh, get stuff done. Keep building up. In how much longer? Ugh, this will take forever to build. Let's see if we cannot infiltrate. Probably as good as it's gonna get. He's gonna swap that back. Yeah. All right. Ever so slowly we are approaching his side. Nurture our capital a little bit. He's gonna capture that or go for it. Definitely strike. I don't have enough points. Damn!
I need more. More, give me more. Yeah, got it. All right, so that will cut off this particular section of his. And like it much, much more easy to take him down because I want to get rid of the poison crusade and take all of this in my pocket. So I can focus on building stuff and dealing with just the regular useless, uh, the regular people. We're already some ways into finishing uh, into this campaign. Anyway, that's it for this episode. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.